everybody, RV Debs here. I took and put my awning out. It's not up all the way, but it is out. I couldn't do it and I thought, I'm gonna have to go get some help, but I didn't. I did it on my own, that's right. I'm glad to say, starting to uh, just do things I have to do, right Rosie? Rose. What do you say to the people? Can you say good morning? Can Lily say good morning? No? I think you should be able to say good morning, but she just can't. Oh, goodness gracious. Say hi. Hi, Rosie. Oh, yes. Another day. Good morning, YouTubers. RV Debs here. It is now Sunday. Yeah, Sunday at about 10.20 in the morning. I am uh, waiting today uh, at noon, between noon and 2. I hope at noon. Uh, the cable guy's coming to uh, make sure that my TV in the bedroom is hooked up. Um, I guess he just hooked up the one and didn't hook up the other. Lily, stop. Lily whines. You whine a lot. You want to come up here? Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Hurry up. Come on. Come. I know. We want to. There we go. Okay. All is well. Sit down. Yep. So, like, um... After the cable guy comes, then I'm going to be, um, this afternoon heading over to the old house, and uh, I think BJ's going to meet me there, I hope. We're going to start with all the empty bins. We're going to load them all up with stuff that's coming over on Wednesday, and I'll probably bring a few more things like food. I have nothing here, so I'm going to empty my freezer and my fridge, and then come back here. I don't want to stay at the house anymore. Um, I don't know what happened. I just, I won't be staying there anymore. I, I kind of get there and I just want it to be all over. You know, I just want it to just all be done. But in a few more days, it will be. Time is flying. I just can't believe it's June 28th. Yikes, another month has gone by. I am trying to keep a good positive attitude. Um, I do like my my travel trailer. Um, Christina is a really cute little house. It's kind of like having one of those like tiny nation homes, tiny homes. Very close. It's actually it is. Um, only mine. Well, I don't know. They they move theirs too. Some of them, but anyway, it's movable. And um, yes, there's going to be a lot to put away on Wednesday. And I will find out if I have to get rid of even more things, which I already know that um, I have too many dress clothes. And uh, But I might take and pack a huge box and send it to Texas where Kat is. She told me, you know, don't give it away if you don't want to. So I'm thinking that I might do that with all the extra stuff that I really like. And I can always get rid of it later. Lily. You're in my way. Lily's looks like a cat in a way. She's in heat, by the way. So she's feeling weird. Yes. She said I could get pregnant. But she's not gonna have babies because she's too little. Yeah. I'm gonna get her fixed sometime in the near after she's done with her heat. Yeah. Rosie's already been fixed. Not that I wouldn't love a little tiny baby coming out of this little tiny baby. Wouldn't that be neat? But, no, that's, first of all, dogs are costly, and um, I can't really, you know, the vet bills, two is plenty. That's right, two is plenty. So, um, I've been walking the dogs every morning. I got up this morning early, which is rare for me to get out of the house at all in the morning. And I walk them in the afternoon. They love it. And this park has lots of nice grass around here. And um, they've got these uh, little stations where you can get a, a doggy bag to scoop up any remains of the pups. 
And um, so I like that, and they love it. Uh, are they thrilled with the house? I don't know. I mean, there's not much runaround room because they like to play and run. And they don't have their toys here. They've got a couple Chewies. So I have to bring some stuff over later that like that, like the dog toys and uh, stuff in the freezer and the fridge. Nothing heavy. I really can't. I, You know, the door that was hanging... It was so in my way that um, before I went to bed last night, I opened my bedroom door and I just picked it up and tossed it out there. It's laying outside. I got to get rid of it, but I can't pick it up right now. So it's gone. At least I can walk around my bed without, you know, bumping into it. And it's all right. You know, I'm going to change things around as I, uh, as I live here. But right now, um, Everything's working. The air conditioning is great. It's cool. Um, the water's pressure was just fine. I took a shower. Um, enjoyed the shower. It has one of those, what do you call it, um, the bars that go out like a big circle so your shower gets bigger. It's got that, and that helps. I really enjoyed the shower. At least I've got a good shower. And the toilet's good. I mean, it's real close. It's, everything's very close kitchen. I like the stove. I, I, I like having a gas stove. Um, I'm going to have to figure out. I've got stuff over at the at my house, like um, what do you call those? Um, <laughs> they're board, cutting boards that I can put over half the sink to give myself more counter room. But that's just little things that'll get done as, as I move my stuff over. Everything else, I'm very grateful that I'm, you know, in here. And uh, I, I'm a little nervous about how my life is going to happen from here on in. But there are no guarantees in life. And um, I've made some big changes. So naturally, things are going to just keep changing and, and moving forward. I'm going to stay here for the month of July. And I'll probably uh, get out in August. I don't have to leave here until October. That's when somebody else comes in to this space. I don't want to get lazy and just stay here. It's just it's a big it's a big thing pulling the trailer for me. I got to get I'm going to get four new tires on the truck. Get the brake controller and the brakes and the truck working together. And that's all I need to do on that. So, that's it for me today. I'm going to try to get in the pool. And uh, enjoy that also. It looks really... Now, the crazy thing is, I walked by the pool yesterday with Esther. We were walking the dogs, and uh, the pool says it's closed at 8 p.m. It's still light out at 8 p.m., and that's kind of when you want to go to the pool when, it, when the sun's not beating down on you and you just want to cool down. So that's kind of crazy. Oh, well. Anyway, this is getting to be long, and I don't need it to get any longer. I hope you all have a great day. I will try to make it to the hangout, uh, RV Ladies Woman Hangout tonight. We'll see. Um, and you all enjoy your day. Thanks for all the comments. I am trying to answer every single one of them. I've done, I'd say, 80%. I have a little more to go. And um, thank you for making the comments. A lot of them are just so wonderful. And the ones that tell me things, it's okay. I don't mind. Um, some, some stuff is the truth, and I know it. I'm not a child. Uh, my goal is to uh, move everything in here, lose weight, walk around a lot, eat small portions, and, um, you know, just start feeling better. Because right now, physically, I'm not feeling real good. And I am very... I don't know if the word is lonely, because... I'm not lonely, but I am alone. It's the strangest thing. I um, It's hard when you see other families doing things together and, you know, you're home alone or you're with the dogs and that's it. But I am okay, and thank God I have a good head on my shoulders and I'm going to be fine. I love you all. Subscribe if you haven't. If you found me, go back and, you know, look at the videos of what got me to this little RV full time. I'm in here. This is it. I've got a house on wheels now. And I, I like it. I don't mind it at all. And I'll talk to you all later.
God bless you all.